we have here exhibit A. She does look like a dark web version of Doja Cat, but yeah, an entitled woman who has yet again made the internet talk about it. And we're here. We're going to bring it to you. Stay tuned because we're going to get into it now. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Tickle that notification bell to let you know whenever I upload a brand new video. Today, we are here to talk about, yet again, a woman's entitlement. So we're going to give Exhibit A the entitlement evidence. This woman says... That any man that wants to take her on a date must first pay a $500 fee. What are your thoughts? One, men, I blame you partially for this because a man sets the tone. So if a man sets the tone, then this woman is obviously getting $500. Obviously, this woman has enough balls and enough guts to ask a man for $500 because she feels that she is that attractive. This woman feels like she is that attractive to ask a man or any man for $500 to even date him. Let's roll the clip. Due to the fact that men make my ass itch i have decided that i am single celibate and no longer willing to date anyone however if you insist on taking me on a date there will be a 500 hundred dollar fee what bro what are you talking about man that 500 hundred dollar fee can be paid through zelle cash app or apple pay i'll send you my phone number and you can send the motherfucking phone then we can discuss an arrangement. However, if you decide that you're gonna text me or call me before you send the motherfucking buttons, you will be blocked. Yeah, that's how we gonna do that. So as you can see by this clip, this woman is entitled. She is entitled because she feels entitled enough she has enough gall to ask for a $500 fee. So I ask you, would you give her $500? Would you give a woman $500 just to get on a date? What would you do? Would you do it? Because I wouldn't. But at the same time, we also have to look at women. We live in the age of modern women, so modern women are trying to get something for nothing. It's like you're going to the car dealership and you have bad credit, no money down, no nothing, and you're trying to get a brand new 2023 Mercedes. And that's the problem with modern women is that they're, they act like they're Mercedes level women when they're really average or below. Because they have delusions of grandeur because there are still men out there that would get with these women. The reason why there are entitled women is because there are simps and tricks and incels and migtails and losers who would give this woman $500. There are men out here that would give and simp for a woman. There are men out here that would get online and pay for a woman just to be in her presence. There are men out here that do not have game that would literally shell out 
thousands upon thousands of dollars and get nothing in return. And this is the dating age that we're in because there are men out here that are losers and lames which give this woman so much entitlement. And see, this is the problem with women is that women have been empowered a loser guy to feel that they are attractive. This woman is not even attractive like that. She's like an average woman and she does look like a dark web version of Doja Cat, but yet there are still people out here that will look at her. If you notice in a lot of these videos where these women are acting entitled, haven't you ever noticed that these women are average or below? Cheesecake Factory lady, she was average. This woman, average. Other entitled women, average. They're average. What man is piping these average women's heads up to get them to feel like they're above average? There has to be some man somewhere telling these women that they are more attractive than what they are. It's time for us to stop putting women on a pedestal. A woman is a human being. It's time for us to set the tone. We need to start saying no. We need to stop taking these women out on dates and leave them at home. We as men need to set the tone. Stop taking these entitled women out. Stop giving them money. Stop taking them on dates. Stop allowing them to film. Stop it. Stop it. Get some help. Because once you set the tone, and if all of us do it as a collective, guess what? The entitlement will stop. We have to set the tone. And then once the tone is set, the women will have no choice to follow. Anyway, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.